Thousands of people are in Detroit today to pay their final respects to Aretha Franklin, the Queen of Soul. Kenneth Craig has more from the Motor City. Aretha Franklin got the red carpet treatment one final time as her casket arrived at Detroit's Greater Grace Temple. A line of pink Cadillacs lined the street outside the church, a nod to lyrics in Freeway of Love, one of Franklin's greatest hits. 18 performers and more than 15 speakers are honoring the Queen of Soul during what's expected to be an eight-hour long, star-studded celebration of her life. This is not the Grammys, this is not the Oscars, this is church, and we're going to send her out just like she came in. Today's funeral caps almost a week of tributes here in Detroit to the 18-time Grammy Award winner. A who's who list of Franklin's contemporaries came to pay their respects. I feel so good feeling all of this love that her music has brought to the world. And we'll have her music forever, and her spirit will live on. You gotta give her the respect mm -hmm. and give her the credit of bringing such a wonderful sound to all of us. Sabria Hakim waited in line since Thursday afternoon after hearing some fans would be allowed inside the church for what originally was an invitation only event. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I am so sleepy, but it was worth it. This is a, a historical event. And I am so glad to be a part of this. A send-off befitting of a queen. Kenneth Craig, CBS News, Detroit.